Hey, what's up? I'm going to show you how to quickly delete excess repositories on GitHub. And so I'm at my profile page, github.com slash my username. I'm going to click on repositories right here. And then you can see I've got 43. Um, most of them are forks from other GitHub sites. One thing I notice people seem to do is they seem to when they first start using GitHub, they seem to fork projects instead of like starring them. And I think that's what I must have done more often in the early days. So I have some stuff that I just don't necessarily care about. Like, what's this notebook? Is that the actual Python program? No, apparently that's not a fork. Should have looked at that. So I'm going to keep that one. So you can see I didn't, where's one, there's one that says forked right under it, right? So if you're trying to go for the forks and you just want to get those and not your original repos, that's one thing. So this one, I probably just committed like a little change or attempted to or something like that. Um, let me see if I did any commits in here. Nope, doesn't look like I did. So this is a good candidate. Sorry, I should have probably been more prepared. So I'm going to click back here to get to the main thing. We go to settings. And then on the first thing, you just scroll all the way down. Very bottom choice, delete this repository. And if you haven't logged in for the day, they'll probably ask you for your password after this. But all you do is just double click on the name and then drag it over to your username. Let go of the left button. Click it one more time and hold the button down and drag it straight down. Boom. That saves a lot of typing if you have to delete like 30, 50, whatever repositories. I understand the consequences. A few seconds later, it's gone. And then you can just uh, try and jump back to your repositories. Some of this stuff isn't very conducive to that. Okay, there we go. That's probably the easiest way, I guess. The most universal way is just click on your profile. Get back to repositories. You can, of course, order them. By, so we could say... Uh, forks right here and just filter them all by forks and then what are our sorting options and by language of course so anyway that's the trick is there one more in here that I'll, I'll go ahead and delete this MX thing Oracle doesn't like me anymore anyway so I don't need to hang on to their code all right once again settings Drag it all the way down, scroll all the way down if your mouse wheel works. Double click the name, drag it over, drag it down, and you understand. A lot of these companies, I think they just choose what would lower their support costs versus what is enabling for a user, especially a power user, to carry out. So, anyway, maybe that helps you out. Thanks for watching.